of sponsors, uh, but they also do, they do a lot of like marketing and stuff. So they do a lot in terms of like getting me out there, like, you know, start, you know, crawl before you walk, boom, boom, boom. Uh, you know, get me on flyers and stuff, like little like UFC parties, like at local bars and stuff, just to get my name out there, build a little fan base locally first, and then, you know, expand it from there. With Joey, uh, Joey's a unique uh, personality. It's nice, you know, you, in this business, you run into a lot of fighters that they expect you to pretty much just market them that's your job but whereas with Joey he's really proactive he's out there marketing himself you know he's he's out there and he, he has a website that he does he does a daily blog he's out there teaching classes uh, he also he has one of the best just like personalities overall uh, he is extremely funny extremely personable uh, extremely outgoing he's uh, can do a Michael McDonald impression that no one has ever seen except for Michael McDonald I think I mean he's out there DJing and, and so, you know, when we get someone like that, it makes it so much easier for us to work with them. They're different from other f clothing companies, whereas they really focus on marketing the fighters that they are also sponsoring. So, it's, they're really cool. The bigger and brighter the Joey gets, it's just a reflection upon us. We're not trying to make ourselves bigger than the athletes. The athletes are the stars and Joey's one. Every single moment with Joey's amazing and funny and stinky. Brian's the homie. Hans is cool too. Hans, can, Hans laid a smackdown on some people. I wish Hans would fight, but Loco's, Loco's kind of a big girl. A little metro. He's shaving his freaking shoulders right now. That's amazing. How many people come into an office and go, can I have a razor? Not for my face, but for my shoulders. My shoulders. He's got hairy shoulders. Love the guy to death, and that's why he's part of the Triumph United team, just because we know his potential, we know what he's capable of, and his personality just meshes with us. You know, we're, we like to have fun. You know, we, we want to go and have a good time. We don't, it's a business, of course, but at the same time, you know, you have to love what you do, and you have to be stoked every morning to come into the office and work. And when you have guys like Joey that you're working with, I mean, it makes your, your job a lot easier. So we're, we're super excited and glad that Joey's part of it. And, you know, hopefully we'll just continue to grow together as a company. Cool. Anything else? I think it's time, you know. I, uh, I'm just embracing it. It is what I want to do. Every time before my fights, even all my little, all these last ones. Every time, like I get nervous before, I just have to like sit down and like talk to myself and be like, "This is what you want. Like, you're getting what you want. You put the work in. Now just go out and get it." The person I'm fighting is definitely will be the toughest person I've ever fought in my life. It don't matter who I'm fighting, where I'm fighting. I could be fighting in front of 50,000 people in a sold out arena. At the, at the end of the day, like, it's just me and that other person and the world stops and it's all about me and another person. I'm just gonna win. Now he's evolved as a, as a fighter. Um, I think he's probably evolved more than even our team. I think our family deserves to have um, a winner, you know, in it and why not, why not better have, than have it be Joey. As somebody who's willing to stand and fight, willing to stand and bang with anybody, regardless of who it is in front of me. May not be the most technical fighter, but definitely have one of the guys with the most heart and willing to lay it all on the line. Looking out my window, I'm seeing all your pain. All this hypocrisy in this world is driving me insane we sold out our own future for a pot of